Hi everyone, this is Shirley from Shirley's World and happy March 1st. Uh, I wasn't going to go uh, thrifting, but I did uh, decide to go to my Goodwill because I had seen something last week that I didn't pick up and I wish I would have all week. It was something to give to somebody else. It didn't have anything to do with my reselling business, but of course, it still wasn't there, but uh, so here's what I got. Uh, I didn't really intend on getting a lot of things because I do have a lot of things upstairs to photograph and list yet. Uh, I spent the morning uh, watching a couple YouTube videos, and then I did list four things. I have four more to list uh, that's already photographed, and then I have to go back upstairs and photograph a whole bunch of other stuff. So, but I want to show you what I got uh, from this short little haul. I was only then in there maybe an hour. Uh, and a couple of the things I already gave to Dexter, I got to him two big stuffed animals because he pretty much gutted everything he had. So I got him two more, a dog and a bear. And he's out there working on this. <laughs> so I did get another couple stuffed animals when I was looking for uh, something for him. I got this little guy from Dr. Seuss. It has the Dr. Seuss tag on it. it still has the hanger. Uh, I don't think they're worth anything, but I didn't look them up yet. He has some beanies in his feet, so the dog can't have him. And then I saw, anytime I see a bear that's dressed up in sweaters and things, I always look at them. Uh, he has a cute little flag sweater on and a hat. And his tag uh, is a kind that I haven't heard of. Pickford Bears Limited, and this is Cody, and he's called. They're called the Brass Button Bears, and the brass button is on his hat right there, and it says Pickford uh, Brass Button Bear on there. So I have to look him up. I don't know if he's worth anything or not, but he's cute. <laughs> I should start listing my boys bears. I used to sell Boyd's Bears in my store, my antique and craft store. And I have a whole bag of them that I can't, can't leave sit out anywhere because the dog will uh, just destroy them. So they're no good sitting in a bag, so I might as well start listing the Boyd's Bears. <laughs> okay, let me show you what clothes I got today. Uh, all jeans were 35% off. Uh, that was the manager specials. The only, the other thing was, um, it was half off on blue tags, which I don't think I got many. But for anything that I didn't have a blue tag or the manager special, um, I had a 30% off coupon, which just took which just started today because every month you get a 30% 30, 30 coupon. Uh, so I have them activate that so, because pretty soon I'll be getting another 35% off one. So sorry. Uh, this was in the men's Harley Davidson uh, je black jeans. They're just regular black jeans and they're size 40 by 30 I think yeah 40 by 30 in the uh, relaxed jeans they're kind of scruffy on the uh, you know on the hems but these are for rough Harley riders so I don't think that will really matter that much <laughs> so I got I picked that pair up because they were 35% off with the jeans. Okay, here's a pair of Under Armour 
shorts, men's shorts. I think these are uh, large, loose fitting, and they're Na Notre Dame, which caught my eye. They're in really excellent condition. So I don't know. I'd pick them up and see what happens. And then a pair of shorts with, uh, these are men's shorts, new with tags in a size 34, and they are Lucky Brand, and they are all linen, gray linen with the cargo pockets on the legs. So they're new with tags. Get those. And these were half price with the blue tag here. And uh, these are Boy Scouts of America. These are like the troop leader pants, I guess. They're men's size 32 in this olive uh, color and the uh, cargo pockets on the legs. So I think it's good to pick up Boy Scouts, Boy Scout things. I had heard that a long time ago. I think I had something else Boy Scouts one time, way in the beginning. I sold. So I got those. And in the women's shorts, this had a blue tag, so it's fifty percent off. So these were like a two, two dollars or less. A little pair of really short little shorts these are a size two petite really small but they're ralph loren or loren R ralph loren so a nice little pair of shorts in this pretty little pattern this little uh, raw edge shorts has the uh ralph loren taggy there the metal letters And this was considered jeans, even though they're capris, uh, in a girl's or women's size, what are they, 26, little, little size, but they're Hudson. See the little sign right there, Hudson? And there's the British flag right there, and they say Hudson in them. So just a pair, little pair of jean capris in a good brand. And I found uh, this little hoodie zips down the front. And this is an Athleta brand, which is good, in a medium. This blue uh, color has some zipper pockets and thumb holes in the arms. It does have some pilling that I will have to go over with my uh, sweater shaver. But usually that gets, uh, get, uh, gets pilling off pretty easily. It's not too bad. This is minor. So the, the first thing I saw when I went in is probably my best buy. I can pick up here without dumping it. Can you tell what's in here? <laughs> I'm sorry that they wrote the four. It cost me $4. Well, 30% off of that. They wrote it right on the canvas bag, or this little gauze bag. But they are all wooden, uh, nice wooden alphabet blocks. There's a lot of them. I didn't count them or anything yet, but I have to get them all out and set them up and count them and take pictures of them. But I know they go pretty well. People use them, uh, if they don't use, give them to their kids, they use them for crafting 
and making things and uh, whatever. So I have a nice big bag of them here. So I thought that was good. It was 35% off of $4. So I thought that was a good buy. When I looked them up on uh, eBay, uh, they were like $20, 30 $40. So okay. then I got, well, this doesn't count because this is for me. They had some new uh, selfie sticks. I never had one of these. So I paid, they, they were marked $3. I paid $35 off of that. So. I think it's just this pole. I don't think it has the uh, connection. <clears throat> it has the holder and everything. So, I don't know. I always was going to send for one and never did. So, I got one. Then, I was, I was going to take a picture. I looked over at the CDs and the DVDs and the games and stuff, and they were like, four guys over there going through them all and i thought well i should have taken a picture of their back going through them because it's like i might as well just not even go over there <clears throat> one i could see and one was going through books and he had his uh scanner out so so when i went over i just pulled out everything that was new packaged hasn't been opened so this is uh, a complete first season of, of Entourage. I haven't looked any of these up yet, but being brand new, I mean, it's got to be worth a little bit of something. Uh, the Harrison Ford and Liam, ne Liam Neeson, K-19, The Widowmaker. Brand new DVD. A DVD or yeah, DVD. Uh, this one is called Nine. I don't know. I never heard of this movie, but Nine is by the uh, same director that directed Chicago. Get five Golden Globe. Board. So, so these were like a uh, a dollar, maybe maybe less than a dollar. I forget what DVDs normally are over there because I never buy them. This one I did look up, and it was going from anywhere from six or seven dollars up to fourteen dollars. So, this is a brand new uh, the notebook. Uh, DVD, New Line Platinum Series. I don't know what that means, but so this was worth uh, something. So I decided I'd just try. I wanted to get other things into my inventory, so a few more things. And that's it. That's all I got. And I forgot to put up the... Uh, let me know if you like to. Uh, let me know if you like that I've put some other things about my horses and that on my YouTube channel. Because <clears throat> whether I'm going to get this up is iffy. Oh, here I am. Iffy. So I'm live right now. If anybody uh, is here, doesn't look like it's sort of a bad time to be on uh, 1 30 in the afternoon uh, on a Friday. But if, if you would leave a comment uh, about whether you mind me having other things on my channel other than uh, my reselling things, like I had a couple things about the horses on there, 
And uh, if you like that or don't like that, what's your opinion? Whether I should do that or not. <laughs> and uh, also, don't forget the questions. Keep adding questions. I'm going to, I go through each, uh, each of my YouTube videos and copy down the questions. And then one of these will be a question and answer uh, video. So I'm going to go have lunch now and another cup of coffee and then continue on with my listing. These things I'll put off uh, to the side. I have to cut off tags and then take them up to be uh, photographed if they don't need washed. Some of these things, a couple of these things I'm going to wash. But So that is all for today. I wasn't really expecting to do to go uh, thrifting, but I did just a little bit. So happy first of March, and I'll see you the next time. Bye.